Good morning, my family. I have a little bit of a cold today, but I am healed by by his stripes. Jehovah Rapha is my healer, and I speak life over my situations, and I thank God for healing me in Jesus Christ's most holy, holy name. I pray the blood of Jesus over any and all who are led to listen to this audio message but from Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. I put on the full armor of God that I might stand against the wiles of our adversary. I put on the helmet of salvation. Let the same mind be in me that is in Christ Jesus. I put on the breastplate of his righteousness, the righteousness of our risen King and Savior, Jesus Christ. I put on his belt of truth, for he is the way, the truth, and the life, and none shall come to the Father but through the Son. I pick up and I equip his sandals of the gospel of peace, and I ask that he lead me this day so others might see his light of mercy, grace, love, and forgiveness shine through me. I pray to be as wise as a serpent, yet as harmless as a dove. I pick up and equip his shield of faith, which quenches all the enemy's fiery arrows, missiles, darts, and all spiritual attacks that come against me. For it is written, No weapon formed against us shall prosper. I pick up and equip his sword of the spirit of truth, sharper than any two-edged blade and activated by the word of God. Greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world. And if God be for us, who can be against us? He is our shield and our buckler and even our strong high tower. He is our protection from all evil. The Lord my God is my provider, Jehovah Jireh. The Lord my God is my healer, Jehovah Rapha. The Lord my God is our blessed hope. The Lord my God is our kinsman redeemer. And the Lord our God is our salvation. Jehovah Nisi and Jehovah Am Kodesh. Glory to God in the highest, for he alone is worthy of praise. He goes before us and he makes a crooked pathway straight. He is our rear guard. I thank God for my brethren and for all that I have. And I prayed the prayer of putting on my armor every day so that you will all know how important it is in these days we are living through. I have a word today from our sister Deborah Walden Fry. Many are the arrows aimed at my warriors. Beloved, many are the arrows aimed at my warriors. Many are the hurts you have suffered, even in the house of your friends. Know this, dear one, I am well acquainted with your griefs and sorrows and your rejection. I know what it is like when men hide their faces from you and pretend you are not there. I know what it is like to be despised. They look upon me with indifference as they look upon you, my child. They judge you by your outward appearance and esteem you not, just as they did your Savior. But know this, my child, the Son was rejected so that you are accepted in the Beloved. I am he who will never leave or forsake you. I am a shield for which absorbs every fiery dart of the enemy. My holy presence in you is a shield of light scattering every spirit of darkness to the winds. Amen, little bird, amen. No longer allow the weapons of rejection and fear to pierce your soul. I am a shield about you, your glory, and the one who lifts your head. No weapon formed against you shall prosper, my warrior bride. You are not powerless, my love. Oh, no. Let not the tribulations of this world overcome you. But my overconquering love for you shall make you triumphant over all the hurtful arrows of the enemy. They shall all fall to the ground harmless. They shall not hit their mark. Fear not, my mighty warrior. In this world you will have tribulation, but take heart, I have overcome the world. I am your shield and helper and your glorious sword. Your enemies will cower before you, and you will tread upon their heights. Isaiah 53 and 3. He was despised and rejected by men, a man of sorrows, acquainted with grief, grief, like one from him whom men hide their faces. He was despised, and we esteemed him not. Matthew 8 and 17. The intensity of his sympathy made him feel the pain 
of others as his own. John 1 and 10. He was in the world and through the world was made through him. The world did not recognize him. Genesis 15 and 1. Fear not, I am your shield and your exceedingly great reward. Psalms 3 and 3. But you, O Lord, are a shield about me, my glory and the one who lifts my head. Deuteronomy 33 and 29. He is your shield and helper and your glorious sword. Your enemies will cower before you and you will tread upon their heights. Romans 8, 3 and 7. Know in all these things we are more than conquerors through him that loved us. Corinthians 2 and 14. But thanks be to God, who in Christ always leads us in triumphant procession, and through us spreads the fragrance of the knowledge of him everywhere. Ephesians 6 and 16. For above all, taking the shield of faith, with which you will be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked one. John 16 and 33. These things I have spoken to you, that in me you may have peace. In the world you will have tribulation, but be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. Luke 10 and 19. Behold, I give you authority to trample on serpents and scorpions, and over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt you. Glory to God in the highest, for he alone is worthy of praise. Trust in no man and trust in no moment, but put your full faith and trust in Jesus Christ, our risen King and Savior. Glory to God in the highest. I was praying today, earlier, and I was on laying prostrate on the floor, and I again released everything to the Lord. I released him the salvation of my family, the salvation of my wife. the salvation of me. I know that alone I cannot do it. That I need a savior. I asked him to cleanse me. And to heal me from the inside out. Glory to God in the highest, for he alone is worthy of praise. I pray that Father God would place his hedge of protection round about you, on every side, above you and below you, over your homes and your vehicles, over your places of work and worship, over your pets and your provisions, over your children, their schools, and their activities. I pray that he would place his hedge of protection around you the same as he placed around Job and his family, in Jesus Christ's most holy, holy, holy name. Glory to God in the highest, for he alone is worthy of praise. Glory to our risen King and Savior, in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. I love you all, my family, and God bless you this day.